Here's a vectors example you can screenshot and try yourself. So what you want to do first is find the resultant force horizontally and vertically separately first. So for horizontal, you got 7,200 and 1,200. So you minus the two to find the resultant horizontal, which gives an answer of 6,000 newtons. For the vertical resultant force, you need to minus the 7,500 by 6,500, which gives 1,000 newtons. Now you can put both of the horizontal and vertical vectors from tip to toe and find the resultant using a right angle triangle, so Pythagoras theorem. That would give you r squared is equal to 6000 squared plus 1000 squared, so you get that, you square root it to find what r is which gives you 6083 newtons. Now we found the magnitude, part two is asking for the direction, so that's the angle between the force and the horizontal. So we can draw a right angle triangle again and this time we're trying to find the angle theta. And we know the opposite is 1000 and the adjacent is 6000, meaning we can use tan theta and say tan theta is equal to 1000 divided by 6000 as its opposite over adjacent. So you can inverse the fraction which gives you 9.46 degrees. 